This is the Max or Manx Well in Comores, East Ayrshire. This big capstone covers the actual spring itself and it lies below Comores Place. The water supply from this spring was very regular and could be relied upon even in the driest of summers. It is said that at one time the local laird took over the right to the water, preventing the local folk from using it. And the well, the spring, dried up and remained that way until the laird changed his mind. The water from the spring used to flow into the Carmel. In very dry summers, the Carmel itself would practically dry up. In the distance there, a small pedestrian bridge used to be stepping stones at one time. It's said that at one time, when the stream completely dried up, the farmers, desperate to get water for their stock, brought carts up here, horse and carts, and they're able to collect water from the spring, the small spout that ran into the, the stream. Sadly, on that occasion, it's said that a child sitting on a cart hit their head against the stone bridge and were killed. It appears that this new fence, which has been built, that the works to construct it have somehow interfered with the flow of the water because the, the sound could be heard of the, of the water splashing into the Carmel from some distance and there appears to be no flow at all and there hasn't been for some time. The well is located next to the Kimors Bowling Club. Hopefully somebody will investigate why the water ceased flowing and put it right. Many of the books spell the name here M-A-A-K-S, but it's said that locals pronounce it more with an N, a sort of Manx. So that could derive from the word monk.